I'll begin this review of somatosensory system with the cross section of the spinal cord shown here with the white matter in the outer portions and the gray matter colored gold here in the center. Anterior is at the bottom of the diagram and posterior is at the top. Labeled is the ventral horn of the gray matter and the ventral root or motor axons leave the spinal cord and the dorsal horn of the gray matter and the dorsal root or primary afferents enter the spinal cord. Let's place that in the vertebra so you can see its relation and you'll see the spinous process of the vertebra and the body of the vertebra and the spinal cord in the canal. Now let's label the dorsal root and then the dorsal root ganglion where the cell body is located and the spinal nerve which is a mixed nerve before it divides into the dorsal root and the ventral root. Looking at a primary afferent, you'll see that it's a, a pseudo-unipolar neuron, meaning from the cell body, the axon splits and heads peripherally to the receptor end, and then and the centrally to the central terminal. And the cell body, again, is located in the dorsal root ganglion. If we draw this even more diagrammatically, it would be drawn situated like this in the cross section of the spinal cord. And that's the type of diagram you'll see from here on in.